Okay, guys, uh, I forgot what part it is, probably part number five. What we did today was we, we did sort of like just an initial cleaning. I mean, you got to understand something. This has been uh, 34 years in its making. It's never been touched. So I don't know if that's good or bad or whatever. But, okay, we basically used what is known as the gunk foam, not a heavy degreaser or anything of that nature, in order to just try to lift the majority of the dirt and everything out of the engine bay, okay? Now, most of these vehicles are made so that they can take water, all right? I'm not gonna get too deep into everything around, but I wanted to give you a look-see. I know it still has a little dirt here and a little dirt here, but you know what? When you get the time, you, you go and go through it slowly, okay? But I just wanted to get all the initial dirt out of the engine, out of the car. As far as this is concerned over here with the fuse box and everything else, I kind of left that alone. I'd rather be safe than sorry, if you know what I mean. Okay, so what do you call it? I did most of the, what do you call it, the side panels over here. You can still see there's some dirt on the inside here, but that's okay. Later on, you take your time and you go through everything, but the majority of all the, the dirt and everything has been lifted off. Okay, this is the front. Just wanted to show you going on I mean you still see a little bit of over here but you know that's that's when you take your time you take your time you go through everything all right but it was much better than before and if you see my previous videos you can see exactly what's going on on that so again you know basically I got most of everything off I tried to clean up as much as I possibly can and try to keep it neat short and tidy okay after this I'm going to wash the car, get everything off of the paint and everything else. As you can see, the top over here needs a little bit of cleaning with, um, you know, again, use a rag, a little bit of, a little bit of whatever wash you want. And you do this thing slowly. Cause this is not a, like a, I, I'll get it done tomorrow type of project. You do it a little bit slowly, a little bit of everything. All right. I wanted to show you everything on this thing so far. Okay. Not bad after 34 years, right? 116,000 miles, Southern California car. Looks pretty clean, very dry. <laughs> yes, there is no problem starting this thing, okay? Uh, we're, not, we're not putting it through like 10 feet of water or something like that. So again, I kind of left a few things alone by itself. I don't want to go too deep into everything. Just an initial car wash on the side, initial things so that we get to get everything done. The radiator in this car was uh, done before, so everything is so far so good. We still need to do a lot of other things. I don't know, maybe a head gasket or something leaking on the bottom, I'm not really sure. We'll have that checked out later, but that's in the mechanical mode of this car, all right? Right now, we're just trying to do exterior. Again, the exterior is basically an overall thing for this car right now. We're not going into like concourse detailing every single single piece. I just wanted to get it, you know, uh, respectable. Back to okay. At least make the car look as if it had like 25,000 miles on it, okay? Anyway, right now, okay, I'm gonna be attempting to work on some windows today, maybe, but uh, I'm gonna wash the car down today. Uh, I don't think I have the energy in order to do the interior today. So the interior is going to be a separate time. I'm going to clean all the rugs and everything that's inside there, the mats. Excuse me, not the rugs, the mats and stuff of that nature. So I just wanted you to see what's going on again with the engine. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoy this uh, little thing. Again, if you're looking for heavy detailing, you can, you can get the other channels, okay? I'm just trying to get this thing in an order in which I'm satisfied for now. Okay, later on, I'll go into a little fine detailing, all right? Okay, guys, hope you enjoy today's Father's Day. Happy Father's Day to everybody.